So, another day out in the field right now. We're just outside the police station dropping off our van. Um, it's about 9 o'clock right now, somewhere around that time. So, we're out in the field going door to door again. Um, there's four of us from our regular nine person team. Um, the rest of our team is still in the office, but I got lucky enough to get out of the office, I guess you could say, and enjoy this beautiful weather. And yeah, not much more to say, just helping out with the flooding and stuff outside of um, volunteer firefighting. And it's a cross between firefighting and police station, so it kind of works out in that way. But yeah, we just parked our van outside so we don't get broken into or anything crazy like that. Yeah, keep you guys posted. So we go out on this adventure. Hey, so it's about 6.30 right now. Just got done with being out in the field all day. Um, we registered a lot of people, so I feel like we were in a more hit area than we were before. Last time we went door to door registering people. So that's a really great feeling to know that we've um, definitely helped and encouraged a lot of people to register for um, federal assistance to help out with any damages that might have been caused in the storms and the flooding that happened here in Louisiana. So that's always good to know that you've really helped. And it's always nice to be out in the field where you're working, talking to people and listen, listening to their story. And everyone's just so nice down here. Um, it's great to talk with them. Um, I've definitely learned a lot by coming out in the field. And I'm definitely happy that I've gotten the opportunity to come out here and do this. It's a really big eye-opener for the most part to know that I'm making a difference and that I'm out here doing this. So I'm definitely happy about that. But yeah, it was another long day, early hours. Um, I was up at 6.30 this morning and then we left at 7.00. We drove to meet our other DSA agents and we were just out all day. We had about an hour lunch break and during that time we went to Hearts Barbecue and it was really really good so that's great. Um, I didn't have barbecue, I had grilled cheese and onion rings but they were really good and I ate all of it so that's great. But yeah, um, dinner is just about done. Turkey sandwiches, homemade, so they look really good and they're heated up and they're warm. Um, we've been locked out of the apartment since we got here because the half of our team went out today. Half of the team stayed in the office. So we didn't grab a key this morning because they needed it more than we did, I guess you can say. So yeah. But we were able to get into one of the apartments, the girls room, which has all the food and all that, or else the guys would just eat it all. That's a joke, by the way. And yeah, um, plans for the night PT. We have to do 45 minutes worth of PT. And so I'll probably do that today, get that over with. We have to do that three times a week, just on our own this week. And then eventually it'll be as a group, which to me, I'm not too happy about. Um, but it is what it is and you just have to do it. So flexibility, right? But yeah, I think I'll end the vlog here. Hope you guys had a great day. 
Hope you guys are going to have a great day, depending on what time you're watching this. And I'll definitely catch you in my next vlog. Hey, so just out here right now for our workout, basically, we have to do it. So, 45 minutes. I saw a tiger. No, but the real one. So, you'll see it. I'll put it right now. Mm -hmm. 